sabihin yung train and coach. For more than 30,000 people nationwide in the areas of success, peak performance, and sales. His Attracting Wealth course is the only Filipino workshop that has produced the most number of multi-millionaires in less than 21 days. days magiging milyonaryo. Ang kaiksite ba yun? Ano mo masarap nito? Yung mga, ano mo yun? That is the course that I already I already, ano, went through. And alam mo, it, it actually works. Okay ba yun? Ang sarap, magiging ano? Sabi mo sa katagawa, nakakili? Diba? Yung mga may po, eh. Yung iba, kahit ano sabi ko, wala sinasabi. Alright? He has been personally trained by the world's best speakers. The likes of, you know, Panin Yumanina, Jack Canfield, kilala niyo mo yun? Yes. John Maxwell? Yes. Yeah. T. Hart Ecker? Tony Buzon, J. Conrad Levinson, and Tony, Tony Burkan, the father of the global firewalk movement. He has been a guest in several TV shows, radio programs, non-profit organizations, universities. And ang good news dito, he has his own TV show. Okay? Ang matindi dito sa TV show niya, lahat ng pwede mo mapanood, puro positive. Ang masarap dito, manood ka ng TV show ni John Calo, lalo ka pangyayaman. Okay ba yun? And you know, the good news is, alright? Mr. John Carlo is here today and he is ready to take you at the top. Are you ready? Something even more interesting for all of you. 
The next two questions that I will give you, if you keep asking yourself this question today, I promise you, hindi kayo makakatulog kayong araw na to. And until the next 21 days. So here's my question. Everybody, let's pay attention. My first question to you is this. Pag-isipan nyo nga to bago kayong matulog pabayang gabi. What if your yearly income becomes your monthly income? Sino kayo gusto nito? Ano mo na yan? Kung yung kinikita mo lang isang taon, kikitain mo ng isang buwan na lang. Isn't that amazing? But let's look at it a little deeper. What if your yearly income becomes your daily income? We want to earn enough passive income that will give us that the money okay, to let us live the lifestyle that we deserve. So what we want to do here is to have a malaking passive income coming to us. Money that is coming to us without working. How many of you would like to earn a lot of money without working? Uh, everybody look at your partner. Friends, simula kayo yung araw, magtutupulan mo na ito. <laughs> Sino gusto mo maging matanda na nagtatrabaho pa rin siya? Nalala ko yung t-shirt ko sa success, uh, sa success TV nung isang araw eh. Start early, finish wealthy. It, the best thing to do if you want to really do this is to start this now. Your chances are for you if you're younger, mas malaki. Now, let's, let's do this. Okay. Let me help you with uh, the concept of financial independence. There's actually a formula for financial, financial independence. Write this down. P is greater than E. P is greater than E. Than E. E as in egg. Eagle. What does that mean? You will know that you're already financially independent, financially free. Hindi mo na kailangan magtrabaho for the rest of your life. Kapag yung passive income mo is already greater than your expenses. Your lifestyle expenses. Na iba-iba naman tayo ng lifestyle. Yung iba, gusto nila simple lang, pero meron din ponga-ponga. Iba, magsapatos lang siya ng, ng ordinary, okay lang, pero yung iba, kaya gusto nila go. Alright? So, iba-iba na lifestyle. Okay. So, our goal is, what I, what again, P should be, our P should be greater than R, E. What is E? Expenses. So, kailangan natin pataasin na yung pang-araw-araw natin na gastos. Oriente, necessities mo, malaki na yung kinikita mo na hindi ka kailangan magtrabaho kasi sa kailangan mong gastos eh. One, one. Simple lang, di ba? Okay. So, how do we do this? Question here. There are two types of a passive income. Okay. Number one, letter A. Can you read that in your workbook? Investment income is money working for you. What's letter B? Ongoing passive income. Let's start with this. Let's first define our goal. What is our goal today? Our goal for, for doing this seminar is for all of us to experience what we call financial independence. Now, after searching for so long or doing a lot of research, this is the best definition I've ever gotten of financial independence. Financial independence is the ability to live the lifestyle you desire, desire without having to work or rely on anyone else or money. Let me repeat that. Financially, you don't necessarily need to write this, just, you know, just go and absorb it or internalize it. It's a financial independence, again, is the ability to live the lifestyle you desire without having to work or rely on anyone else for money. Okay, so if you look at page five, it's written there, gaining prosperity consciousness through the genius creation money magnet man system. 
I always have money account. So how are you going to do this? You go to any mall or palengke or then you buy a telephone. Any plastic telephone. The best to use is something where you can see through the okay, the jar. Don't use an opaque one. Okay? So keep yung uh, clear, clear siya mas maganda para nakikita mo yung pera. Later on, I'm going to explain why. Now, what is the use of this? Okay, that's all. Okay, everybody, I want you to put there first 1%. Everybody in your workbook put 1%. Okay, then sabay-sabay tayo basahin natin ano bang gamit ito. I always have money account. Ready? One, two, three, go. You will put 1% of your income and you will not withdraw the money you put here for the rest of your life. In addition, put some amount of money like loose change in this account today. Now, what this jar will do for you, that I always have money account is this. It will cure one of the deadliest viruses that most people have. What is that virus? I don't have money. So, ibig sabihin, pag lagi mong sinasabi, meron akong pera. I always have money na hindi ko kailangan. What will that do? When you think about that, that you have money, what you're thinking of will expand. And that will magnetize more money into your life. Lalo na dami yung pera mo dahil hindi mo naiisipin na wala kang pera. Now, ito lang yung challenge nito. Bawal na kawan. <laughs>
utak niya. Pinagpaalam na sa US government, pwede po pa namin pag-aralan yung utak ni Einstein. So the government uh, uh, allowed the scientists to study it eh? using sophisticated computer equipment. Sino pa nila yung, yung uh, Brady Einstein? You know what they discovered? It's so funny that sa utak ni Albert Einstein, ang gumagana lang sa utak niya is only 15% of his brain power. He was using only how much percent? <laughs> only 15%. Isn't that crazy? 15%. Ito na yung pinaka matalimong tao sa mundo. The normal human being, the average human being, is using only 5% of his brain power. Ilang percent lang? 5%. Itong 5%, ito na yung mga genius. Ito na sila Bill Gates, sila Warren Buffett, sila Lucio Tan, sila Henry C, sila John Bogomway. Everybody look at your partner and ask your partner, friend, gusto mong gulang ko, ilan ang ilan lang. Sorry, sa point, zero, 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 zero. Now imagine this. What if one day, a man, that has no hair gives you a manual on how it works. And because of that manual, you will be able to use okay, the powers of your mind to reach the levels of income that you have never, ever reached before. That guy is John Calvary. Welcome back sa Success TV. Ito po ang inyong uh, host, uh, John Calub, kasama ko ang aking uh, co-host na napakaganda. Yan, lagi mo sinasabi na big game every Saturday. Pero hindi natutuwa ako. Kasi ako eh, ah, okay yan, nagbibigay ako ng kulay sa buhay mo, di ba? Yes, exactly. Alam mo, boring ang buhay, pero pag nandito sa studio. Yun no, high five! <laughs> We have a multi-millionaire <laughs> mind! <laughs> <laughs> Dami ko natututunan talaga pag umatin ako ng seminar mo, Sir John. Oh. Pero ang, ang, ang na-realize ko doon, totoo pala talaga na kapag meron ka knowledge, power yon Knowledge is power. Totoo ba yon Actually, ma- kung talaga nakinig ka mabuti, nakakagulat, no? Kasi lagi namin sinasabi doon sa seminar na knowledge is not power. Is not power. Yes, kasi yung may bagay kang natutunan mo, nalaman mo, pero for example, yung nalaman mo, hindi mo naman ginamit, hindi mo ina-apply, bali wala lang din yung uh, natutunan mo. So, big sabihin, nalaman mo lang, tapos na. Tapos na. O, anong silbi nun, di ba? Kumita ka ba? Hindi. Kung wala ka naging action para mm-hmm. gamitin yung, uh, yung mga techniques na yun. Tulad sa seminar na yan na pinuntahan natin sa SMX, ang daming techniques na tinuro, di ba? Eh, kung pag uwi mo, hindi mo rin ginamit yung money management system na ishinare natin, mm-hmm. eh, Anong mangyayari? Yung, yung pinunta mo doon, bali na bali, wala lang. So napaka-importante na, na you put what you know into action. Kaya nga, ang sinasabi namin sa seminar, eh, knowledge is not power. Ito yung sinasabi namin. Makikita mo sa t-shirt ko, wisdom is power. Wisdom is power. Anong pa pinag-aiba ng wisdom tsaka knowledge? Pag sinabi mo kasing wisdom, this, it means knowledge in action. Knowledge in action. Ibig sabihin, yung... Uh, yung in- inaalam mo ay mga bagay na uh, alam mo rin sa sarili mo na magagamit mo ng, sa practical na bagay mm. and then more than that hindi mo lang inalam talagang ginamit mo siya para maging mas maasenso ka so ibig sabihin merong may resulta may gagawin merong, ka may gagawin ka talaga 
So marami rin kasi pumunta sa mga seminars natin na akala nila pag pumunta sila, natutunan nila, tapos na dun eh. Ang hindi natin makokontrol yung ikaw ba na pumunta ka dun sa seminar, talaga bang ginamit mo yung na-pick up mo doon? Kasi hindi ko na mag- wala na akong magagawa kung hindi rin naman nila uh, in-apply. So napaka-importante lagi namin ni stress uh, kung ano man yung assignments sa seminar, kailangan mo siyang sundan. Kasi hindi siya, ano lang, para siyang workshop na meron ka talagang gagawin. Oo oh, nga. So, sayang yung inupo mo ng buong maghapon doon kung hindi mo rin lang man gagawin, exactly. di ba? So, yung una kong tanong sa'yo, ikaw ba meron ka na ng mga garapon? <laughs> Oo, oh, oh, meron ako. Anim yon <laughs> Meron ka ng jars. Meron akong jars. Ayon. At uh, medyo sinisimulan ko na lang siya. Um, hinihintay ko kasi yung, yung sweldo na... Sabi mo, isi-segregate mo yung Tama. ganitong percent, mapupunta rito, para magkaroon siya ng routine. Yes, then ang susunod mo naman gagawin, yung mga jars na yon nire-represent lang nun yung mga bank accounts. So, magta- mag-open ka ng separate bank accounts hmm. for that. Kasi pag malaki na yung pera mo, hindi na, la- hindi na kakasya dun sa jar eh. Oo. So, ide-deposit mo lang sa bank. Oo. Tapos yung deposit, yun ang hinuhulog mo dun para Anim yung jars ko eh. Ah, anim, anim yung jars. Good. Yung tights, ano pa ba yun? Yung... Meron tayo din tawag na... Uh, pag... I always have money Oo, jar. Oo, yun ang paborito ko eh. Kasi hmm. pag nakikita mo yung jar mo, may laman na pera, hindi mo nasasabihin so, sa sarili mo na wala akong pera eh. Pag sabi mo, wala akong pera. Ano ba magnet mo, di ba? Oh, wala ka nga pera. Maubusan ka ng pera. Pero pag nakita mo, uy, dumadami pera ko. Alam mo, dadagdag ako yung jar ko. Ano Ganon ka lang yung jar. Ano yung lalagay mo? Lalagay ko, John Callum's donation to me jar. <laughs> <Sige>. <laughs> May sustento <laughs> sa akin. <laughs> I-attract mo yan. <laughs> Sige, so bago tayo umalis, uh, partner. Siyempre, katulad nga na sinabi natin, application is the key to wealth. So, okay. ito yung, uh, yung magiging uh, t-shirt. Wisdom is? Power. Power. Yan. Para din sa mga nanonood, ito yung ating uh, uh, parang ubaga key uh, lesson natin for today. Wisdom is power. Yan. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So kami po ay uh, nasa sad part na naman, magpapaalam kami pero may saya, may ngiti sa mga labi dahil babalik kami sa susunod na Saturday. Oo, next Saturday. Hindi na muna natin siguro sasabihin pero uh, surprise. Big, surprise, maganda yung magiging topic. Uh, siguro bigyan na natin sila ng clue. <laughs> so huwag kayong mawawala ulit. Uh, sa Sabado. But bago kami umalis na isang aming paalala sa inyo, pwede nyo kaming i-add sa Facebook. Pakitype lang po uh, sa search ninyo, Success TV. At uh, kung gusto nyo namang sumulat sa amin, meron ba kayong ideas na gustong i-feature? Baka kayo mismo gusto nyo maging guest namin dito sa sa Success TV. Sumulat lang po sa I love Success TV at gmail.com Okay. Partner, pasalamatan ko lang yung ating mga sponsor. Salamat po sa Mary Kay Cosmetics na pinoprovidean ka na rin ng Mary Kay, ha? Oh. At saka, salamat din sa Diana Stalder and kay Dr. Rachel Lakat. Thank you, thank you. Yes, nice ko rin pasalamatan ang uh, Total Body Dentistry at nandyan, if, of course, yung kapartner natin, sulit.com.ph at uh, yung Business World, the official uh, business paper natin. Okay, paalam na po kami sa inyo. Ito po si Ate Cheska San Diego. At ito po ang inyong Sir John Calum. And, And we, we say, say yes to success! success.